guys good morning welcome back to my channel just start this up real quick i am ordering some starbucks this morning I, this just sounded really good i had to have that in a few days several days i don't i don't remember when i had it last but it's been a little while it's been sometime last week um but i'm grabbing that and then i'm gonna grab ethan some breakfast let me order but i'm doing that i'm sorry this is a terrible angle um i am uh, grabbing coffee and then i'm gonna grab Ethan some breakfast this morning. He woke up late this morning. My, my alarm went off at 5 a.m. He gets up earlier than that. But my alarm went off and I noticed he was still in the bed. And I'm like, are you not going to get up and go to work today? Um, so he finally, he was like, oh my goodness, I'm so glad you set an alarm or I would be late for work. So he got up late today. So I was going to, I offered to get him, get up and fix him breakfast, breakfast before he left. But he grabbed something super quick and left. But I told him I was going to bring him something to work this morning. Um, so, anyways, that's what I'm doing. And then I'm going to go grab some groceries. I got a pretty big grocery order. Um, I also had to get, like, toilet paper and diapers and stuff. I need to make another Sam's Club trip, which I know y'all just saw a Sam's Club video, like, last week. But that video was actually filmed, like, over a month ago. So, I really need to make another Sam's Club trip. So, I did get a few other things that I typically get at Sam's Club. Um, and then I got some really easy... Um, salads for lunches this week i'm gonna make my breakfast burritos again that i made i think two weeks ago and then i'll share with y'all my meal plan too so meal plan grocery haul and then i might share with y'all our dinner tonight which i've shared it before i think i'm gonna make something in the crock pot i might change my mind i'll decide once i get home but that's my plan today that is our day um, i'm gonna grab this yummy coffee that sounds so good i got up and did a 30 minute workout that i actually planned to get up i woke up at 5 a.m because i was going to do a 45 minute workout but i was trying to help ethan get out the door so i just did a 30 minute workout so now i'm ready for my coffee i'm going i'm going grabbing my coffee and ready to get the day started i just dropped a lady off at school too if you guys are new here I'm Haley. I am a mama to four. I share all kinds of stuff on my channel. Vlogs, stay in the life, grocery hauls, what I eat in a day's. I follow the WW plan and I know of y'all. A lot of y'all also do. Um, and just all kinds of stuff. If, so if you're new, I hope you'll subscribe and stick around. Um, a lot of my stuff is very like laid back vlog style. So that's what this video is too. We are home. Gotta put all this stuff on the table. Yeah. I've got to clean out this fridge and the pantry's a mess as well. Um, it's just like we've just been throwing stuff in, but the refrigerator is very unorganized at this point. It's been two weeks since I've done this. Since we were out of town at the meeting last week, I didn't go and get a grocery order. I just would run to the grocery store and I grabbed a few things to last us for the week. Got to do that and then got to do something to this pantry as well. Just kind of organize it a little bit. But um, I am going to put all of this on the table and then oh, clean I out the I fridge. What'd I get? I did not know that. What, oh, the juices? Yeah, I did not Clean out the fridge and I'll we'll share with y'all what I got for our meals. And then a grocery haul and I'm hungry, so. Hopefully, I'm going to go ahead and make my breakfast burritos pretty soon as well. All right, so we've got everything laid out. I don't have enough room on my table, so I've got everything right here, too. So, we did get a lot of stuff this week. Um, like I said, we missed last week, and so I feel like we got a little bit more stuff than we typically get and spent more money than we typically do because, like, a few of these things I usually get at Sam's Club, but I had to get them today. Um, so, I'm going to start right here. So, I got some drinks to refill for Ethan. My favorite diapers are from Target, the Millie Moon diapers. They've been out of his size. So, I used to use these with Millie, the All Goods, and really like them. So, I picked those up to see how he did with those. It's getting to be really warm weather here. So, I got these to stick in the freezer for the kids to have when we're outside. Um, we got some French toast sticks. We, uh, I will share with y'all my meal plan too. We are going to do um, chicken Alfredo. So I got some garlic bread to go with that. This is a lot of bread. This is a really big thing of bread and it was super cheap too. Uh, four onions, I only ordered two, but they gave me four. Um, I got, I don't love frozen chicken, but um, they were out of fresh chicken. So I was like, I'm just gonna give this a try. So we're gonna do grilled chicken one day and then also the chicken for our um, chicken Alfredo. 
got some toilet paper to last us till we can make a Sam's run. Uh, we'll go over here. Um, we're gonna do Philly cheesesteaks. I'm gonna make mine in a bowl, which is one of my favorites. We do that, and then mushrooms and onions with it, and then I also got buns, uh, like bread for Ethan. We got some tacos, uh, we're taco, or <laughs> ground beef, we're gonna do tacos one day. Um, and then I am gonna make some, what is it called? Uh, French dips, French dip sandwiches, which is one of my favorite recipes, crock pot recipes. I might make that tonight, to be, to be decided. I need to put that on like now, if I'm gonna make it tonight and let it cook. Okay, we've got some sandwich bags because we just ran out of those. We've got okay. Callan's uh, breakfast down there. <laughs> uh, do you need more, Callan? So we got Ethan some body wash and then I also needed some body wash for myself. Um, we got some bacon. I'm getting ready to put that in the oven so I can make my breakfast burritos. We, Ethan asked for me to get these. We got these on our last Sam's Club order and we just ran out of them and he loves these. And Delaney really likes these too. You like those too, don't you, Red? But what are they again? The pancakes on a stick. And pancakes and sausage on a stick. Oh, oh. Uh, veggie straws. They've been out of the Walmart brand yeah. like every grocery order for a long time, but they did have those this time. Oh. And I could only get one. They only let me get one. Uh, goldfish. Got some goldfish. All right, we got some cheese. This is for our um, ch uh, cheese dip, or not cheese dip, French dips. And we got some string cheese. We got some corn to go, probably with our grilled chicken. Some lettuce, we got some shredded lettuce to go with tacos and some potatoes for the week. I'm gonna make these for my breakfast burritos and then also for sides this week. Uh, some laughing cow cheese, we got some cucumbers, we got some mushrooms. Let's go back this way. Got a couple things of cinnamon rolls, some beef broth. I also got this beef broth. I don't think I realized I ordered both of them, but this is for this recipe. Uh, I got some drinks for the kids, juice boxes. We've been out of those for a while and I just keep forgetting to get them. Italian dressing, I like to marinate our chicken in Italian dressing to grill that. Half and half for coffee, I got some balsamic vinegar, barbecue sauce, I needed a few spices. So I got garlic powder, garlic salt, and some more paprika. Uh, we got some milk and then some iced coffee, which I ordered the Stoke iced coffee, um, but they substituted the Duncan because I guess they only had one of the Stoke left. Um, I don't, I'm going to give it a try. I don't, I prefer the Stoke over any of it, but I am going to give it a try and see what I think. Um, I have bought the Duncan before, but I don't think it was the unsweetened zero sugar one. So we'll see how I like it. I don't think it's I don't think I'm gonna like it as much as this Stoke, but we'll try it. Also got, they also substituted these, so I'm gonna give these a try, everything bagels. Um, I got Callan a couple yogurts. I'm gonna see, these are expensive, like the pouches like this. I'm just gonna see how he does with them, because I used to get these for Millie a lot, and she'd eat like half of it, and like, it would be like wasted. I'm just, I only bought two of them to see how he did. All right, I got Callan a couple pouches. Um, in case he needs, wants a little something extra for his suppers or lunch. Um, taco kit, I like this one so that way everybody can pick if they want soft or hard tacos. Some Lunchables for the kids, pizza, and then we got a few of the nachos and cheese, but mainly pizza. They really like the pizza Lunchables. Um, muffins, blueberry muffins, we got these for the French chip sandwiches. Also for the Philly cheese steaks, I figured, um, I don't, I figured this will be plenty for the Philly cheesesteaks. The kids don't really eat the Philly cheesesteaks, so we're going to do this, and then for the French dip. So this should be enough for both of those meals. Um, white bread. We got some, I got some more, my favorite tortillas. Got some eggs, which, uh, I don't know if you, I, I don't know if it is the same on your grocery order, but the organic cage-free eggs are actually cheaper than the regular like white regular eggs they were yesterday when i was placing my order which i thought was interesting um and then these are my lunches this week very easy very simple i'd actually planned i actually went to the grocery store last night i was gonna make my own meal prep salads and i went to get some boar's head turkey meat and the deli was closed and i wasn't able to do that so I decided to scratch that and not do that this week. And so I decided just to get these easy salads, which these are really good. I've gotten these before. Um, I got two of the Fiesta salad with chicken. These are five points each. And then let's count how many interruptions I've had in this video so far. Um, you can take a point away for the veggies. So I got two of those and then the everything avocado. I think this is seven points, which you can take a point, obviously take a point away. Um, everything avocado. I don't know if I've tried this one. I can't remember. 
And then the BLT salad. I think this one's eight. So I got those for just super easy lunches this week. Um, and I think, I think I, that's pretty much it. Um, so now I'm going to get started. I'm going to um, clean all this out. I'm going to at least put all of my cold stuff away. And then I'm going to prep my breakfast burritos because I'm hungry. I'm gonna pause on putting my stuff up. I still have all pantry stuff and all that. But I did get my refrigerator done and put some things in the freezer as well. It looks so much better. Um, I was gonna say something. I, I can't remember what I was gonna share. Something about my fridge. We did, uh, Gigi got us some strawberries, strawberry season. So we do have some of those left in here i didn't cut up anything like a, the cucumbers and stuff i will do that but i am just i need to put supper in the crock pot and i'm hungry so uh this is what that looks like i'm getting ready to actually let me take it out i'm gonna go ahead and do the crock pot french chip sandwiches today it just sounds really good for dinner and i know dinner is just gonna be ready to go whenever we're ready to eat all right so first of all i'm gonna go ahead and chop up my onions um I'm going to trim the roast. Um, I've also done a chicken one of these as well, which is really good. I prefer the roast because I do prefer the taste over the beef, over the chicken one. Um, but also my kids um, will eat the roast plain. So I'm just going to like roughly, I think you're, you can quarter this, but I'm just going to kind of and you're also supposed to, well, her recipe, this is from Sweet Savory and Steph. I've made this several times already. But you're supposed to like sear the steak. I'm not gonna do that either. Um, I've done it both ways and both ways are fine. Um, so I'm not gonna worry about that. All right, so I did get the majority of that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and stick that in there. Wash my hands and get everything else in there. All right, I'm now going to mix up some of the sauces. So I'm gonna do about half of this. Actually, I did not need quite that. I only needed a cup of this. All right, that'll work. And then some Worcestershire sauce. Like I said, the recipe will be below for the exact measurements. I'm gonna do a little bit of Dijon. And then I've got our balsamic. All right, we're gonna do a little bit of the balsamic vinegar. Probably put too much of that, but it's okay. We're gonna do some bouillon. And I'm gonna whisk that up. All right, I've got some mixed minced garlic. I'm just gonna stick in there. And then lastly, a couple bay leaves, and that is it. I'm gonna turn it, it's already almost 10 o'clock. I'm gonna turn it on high for like an hour, and then I'm gonna turn it down to low. That way it'll start cooking. That's it, one of my favorite recipes. Then of course I will share with y'all like tonight once I get it like shredded and like how it's served. If y'all hadn't seen me make this before or you can um, also check her recipe um, for the exact measurements, but it is so delicious. It's like pretty good in points for what it is. And then I'll probably like air fry some potatoes to go with it later.
to my breakfast burritos. We're so good. I've got five more left for the week. Um, I actually made six total, but I got this looking a little bit better. Got our cereals. Got this look. This situation right here was a mess. I took a couple more things out of the boxes. It looks a little bit better than it did. And then I just turned this down to low. So we're gonna let this cook until about, I don't know, 6 p.m. tonight. All right, so six, it's about 6.15. Let's get my camera, there we go. It's about 6.15, the roast is done. I did turn it back on high for a little bit because it just wasn't shredding easily. It was just not tender, but now it is. It should be good to go. So I'm going to shred that up and turn that to warm. I'm going to just like shred it up kind of smaller. And then I'm going to make some, I think, some potatoes to go with it. So I've got a fussy boy in my arms, but I've got some like potato wedges, I guess I should say. I just seasoned them as like I did my breakfast potatoes this morning. That's just my favorite. Garlic powder, paprika, onion powder, salt, pepper. Um olive oil spray so we're gonna let those cook good and crispy in the air fryer and i'm going to put some meat on here and then some cheese and bake them in the oven all right the roast is shredded it didn't need much it just basically shredded itself the onions are nice and tender looks good i'm gonna take some of this out kind of get the juices off so it doesn't make the bread too soggy put a little bit of this on each one all right, and then I, I'm just gonna let these heat up and let the cheese melt. All right, they are ready. Nice and the bread's toasted up. So mine, I do the dip, like I dip it in the sauce, just a little bit of the sauce, and then Ethan does not prefer that. I just put a little bit of mayo on his, and that's how he prefers his. We've got our potatoes. Potatoes are zero points for me. So a serving of these, um, a serving of this is like four points, I believe. And then you've got your bread. And I've got to go back and look. I think the bread's five or six points. And then you've got the cheese as well. So you'll just have to like add that up. However much you used to. And that is dinner tonight. It's such a good recipe. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to go ahead and end it out. And we're going to eat dinner. Also got the kids' plates fixed and I'll see you guys soon for another video. Bye!